Love Film and welcome to the very stylish UK premiere of Sex and the City 2. Carrie and the girls are back, but this time things are hotting up as the fashionable foursome head to Abu Dhabi for Sex in Another City. It's been two years, and in two years, amazing things can happen. Things you thought would never happen in a million years. What we really wanted to explore was tradition, this theme of tradition and how we all sort of reinterpret it or, or run toward it or push it away or redefine it and I think that um, that's something that, that's a conversation that a lot of women are having and happily ever after means something for every, something different for everybody. Did you use a stunt double or did you fall on your bum? All, all of the above. I had a stunt double who actually did the part where she hit the ground. Because camels are like, like way up here. Um, but I did fall off, but I fell off onto a mattress held by about eight, eight stunt guys. Oh, wow. Yeah. In this uh, film, we see your character kicking back a lot more, and he's a bit more relaxed behind closed doors. And was that a lot more fun to play for you? It was. It was uh, not as uh, easy as it looked. Actually, there was a, a, a method to Michael's madness when he wrote all that, because I take it not as about being a slut, but as a man who's really found home mm -hmm. with the woman he loves and what home means, the sanctity of it. to ask you, um, there's quite a contemporary twist on tradition in this film. Was that something that you had in mind from the offset? I think that there's always been one villain in Sex and the City, and that is tradition, or society. So when Carrie Bradshaw, who has identified herself as the eternal single girl her entire life, is suddenly now a wife, it's just a really good story, because I think even in New York City, this contemporary woman is having a trouble with a traditional role, so that became the sort of theme for the whole movie, and all of the girls looking at their roles. Sometimes, you just have to get away with the girls. Wow, what a glamorous night. We're gonna go kick up our heels now and have a Cosmo. See you next time. <laughs>